Alright, hello guys. Right now we're talking about Tropical Storm Barry or potential Tropical Storm Barry. We're not at Tropical Depression status yet. We will be very shortly and then Tropical Storm status by tomorrow. Before I get started with this video though, I would ask that you do subscribe if you do like weather related content and you haven't subscribed already. Now, right now we're looking at the National Weather Service's forecast for this system. You can see we're going to be at Tropical Depression status quite soon. And by 7 p.m. tomorrow, we will be at Tropical Storm status. And by 7 p.m. Friday, they're calling for hurricane status. We're going to see this move onshore into Louisiana and eventually downgrade back to Tropical Storm status and then be a Tropical Storm that enters into the state of Arkansas and then Tropical Depression in Arkansas as well and probably affect Missouri, Oklahoma, Texas, Mississippi, Tennessee uh, a lot. So we're going to be seeing... Uh, a lot of rainfall and a lot of winds with this one. At the end, we will have the forecast for those two things by the National Weather Service, so stay tuned for that. But right now, we're looking at our spaghetti models as far as the track. You can see there's still a few that take it to other states, but really a lot of them take this into Louisiana and Arkansas. So worth really thinking that a Louisiana impact at this point is most likely. Kind of the more uncertainty here is whether it's going to head into Arkansas after or Mississippi after. We'll have to keep an eye on that just to, you know, make sure we know who should be really, really prepared for this one. But really, everybody should be on high alert for this one, I would say. Now, here's your intensity guidance. And you can see we're seeing this one head into tropical storm status again by tomorrow. And really, they are uncertain if they want to keep it at weak tropical storm status or a very strong tropical storm or low category one status, maybe even category two, we could get out of this one. So we're going to have to keep a close eye again on this one. That'll be in the next two days. We will see how far it can intensify. Here's your probability of hurricane force wind. And you can see we do have a little bit of a 20 to 30% chance within that very light shade of green. And then that little bit of yellow is a 30 to 40% chance. And this is an increasing chance. So we're seeing the National Weather Service think more and more that this could possibly become a hurricane. So again, we're going to need to keep an eye on the updates. I will be bringing multiple updates for this storm on this channel. So again, stay tuned for that as I will have those out over the next couple of days. Now here's your rainfall forecast, potential tropical cyclone Rainfall forecast, according to NOAA, you can see within those green shades, that's one to four inches of rain. The yellow shade is four to six inches of rain. The orange shade is six to 10 inches of rain. So that's almost all of Louisiana. And then 10 to 15 inches of rain, which is a big chunk of Louisiana. And then 15 to 20 inches of rain in those two pink shades. One is over the ocean. And then one right there you can see is onshore of Louisiana. So that would be a lot of rainfall. And again, we're just going to need to keep a very close eye on the updates for how much rain is expected and how much wind is expected. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.